Hello everyone, LZ1ABC here. Uh, I want to show you how you can uh, draw your transceiver using several softwares. Uh, the idea is that your transceiver has only one soft, the one uh, COM port, and uh, you would like to use several softwares to control your transceiver, to send commands and to receive commands. There are other ways of doing this, of course. Uh, this is just one of uh, them, uh, which was convenient for me. Uh, for the purpose, for this purpose, you need to use two softwares. One is the TRX comma aggregator, which I wrote. It's a Python program with one file here. Uh, you can see it. And the other one is the virtual com port uh, program. I'm using com zero com program, which is open source and free. You can use also VSPE program and also others. Uh, so you have to do the following. You need uh, to go to this address here, you see. TRS com aggregator in uh, GitHub, then go to releases and download the latest release. Save the file, ex extract it. I've done this already because my download speed is very slow from the GitHub. Uh, let me go. Here it is. I've extracted it already. Uh, this is how it looks like. This is the program which you need to start. But before starting, you need to modify the settings file. Uh, here uh, you have the virtual com ports to which your softwares are going to connect and also the TRX com aggregator program. Or in this case it's the TRX com aggregator, I'm sorry, and uh, the softwares will connect to... Uh, let me show you here how it looks like. So the TRX is going to connect to com port uh, 14. COM port 12 and COM port 10. And the softwares, for example, N1MM is going to connect to 15, HD, HDSDR, for example, to 13, and another one to 11. And uh, let me show you how it looks like. Uh, sorry, pressing too much, too fast. So this is how it looks like. Here is the TRX COM aggregator. It communicates with the transceiver over one COM port, serial COM port, and also communicates with several softwares over virtual COM ports. Uh, the idea is that the, the software are sending the, the softwares are sending the commands towards the COM aggregator, which is uh, assembling them in a queue without uh, mixing them and without uh, breaking their integrity and sending them then to the TRX, to the transceiver. And of course the transceiver sending commands to the TRX com aggregator which is sending them to all the other softwares. This is the basic idea. Okay, so here we are. Here is the settings file. I have the com0com, uh, which looks my settings of com0com looks like this. Uh, additionally, in the, se in the settings file of the TRX com aggregator, you have the can uh, the type of uh, transceiver that you're using. It can be Kenwood, ICOM, or Yes, Yes, or Elecraft. Elecraft. These are the four transceivers which are supported currently. I have Kenwood, PS590. Also, you have to specify the COM port of the transceiver, the real COM port, the baud rate, byte size, bar parity, stop bits. This one you don't have to touch. And also, you can uh, set the initial state of the DTR and RTS uh, pins. Okay, so uh, always set. So let me not close it save it. When you're ready to run the program, it's already running, let me stop it. I'll run it. And the program has started, it's already redirecting everything from the uh, COM ports to the real COM port. Uh, if you want to stop the program, press uh, Ctrl C. Okay, and let's see how it looks like. I have my N1MM. I have the COM port for the transceiver 15. And you can see, let me rotate the dial of the transceiver. 
frequency is changing. Also, the HDSDR is uh, also working. Uh, let me show you the settings here of the Omni Rig. Comfort 13. Pod rate is irrelevant. And all this is irrelevant because uh, the com 0 com is not using this data. The settings. Uh, where is my third software? This is my third software. It's my personal program I wrote, a logging program for Bulgarian contest. But also working. So this is the whole idea. We have also sometimes uh, I'm using antenna tuner, which also needs to control the transceiver. Also, another program that you can use is VSPE. It's uh, also free for 32-bit, the 32-bit version, but 40-bit version you need to pay. In this case, the VSP, when you connect virtual comports, you can connect a virtual comport called connector, which is only a single comport to which two softwares can connect. For example, the, in the TRX COM aggregator, you will enter COM20, and for example, in the N1MM software, you also enter COM20. Not like the COM0 COM, where you have a pair of virtual COM port. This is the difference. I think you, here you can also create a kind of a pair. Yeah, sure, you can create also the same way like in uh, COM0 COM. But I'm using, when I'm using COM0 COM, I'm using the connector. Okay, uh, so this is it. Uh, the program is free, you can always uh, download. If you know some Python, you can change. If you need something to be changed, let me know. Okay, so 73 and LZ1ABC is wishing you all the best.